Hi, I'm Alex and today we'll have a look at this mini video kit from US Key Vision, who were so kind to send over this product to test and review. Start it up. First things first, it has a nice unboxing experience and you will see soon why I say this. Inside the box there is a carrying bag, which has a hard shell and is made of quality materials. I am quite happy that they included this bag with their products because it is easier to keep everything in place. As we have a look inside the case we find all the items placed nicely and we start with this manual or quick start guide. Then the biggest item in the box is the tripod with a ball head at the top. The tripod is extendable up to 29 cm or 11.5 inches. Then there is the universal smartphone clamp, which has a nice design. It looks and feels premium. It has one cold shoe mount at the top to add different accessories like a light or a mic, one quarter inch mounting thread hole at the bottom and another one at the back. The microphone is quite light, probably the lightest I've ever held at this size. But it doesn't come with a shock mount, so if you don't move a lot, then it will be fine. It doesn't need a battery to run, at the back it has a 3.5mm auxiliary port, at the bottom it has a hot shoe mount with a quarter inch threaded hole. The next item is the light, it has a removable hot shoe mount at the bottom, a cold shoe mount at the top and a rubber cover which I think can be used as a diffuser. The charging port and the on off button are one next to the other on the same side. To turn on the light press and hold the button for a couple of seconds and to change the intensity of the light press on the button, it has three levels. To turn off the light, press and hold the button for a couple of seconds. On the other side of the bag there are a couple of plastic bags. One of it is with a dead cat to put onto the microphone to block out wind noise if you use it outdoors. Then in another bag there is the foam wind muff and this is what I usually use. Another bag has all the cables needed, well nearly all of them. There is the TRRS cable for the smartphone, a TRS cable for the camera and a micro USB cable to charge the light. The last bag has an action camera adapter which can be used with a GoPro camera for example. To put everything together is child's play. Screw the ball head onto the phone mount, then attach the light and the microphone. If you use a smartphone that has a headphone jack, then the cable in the bag is the only one you need. If you have a phone that doesn't have a headphone jack, then you need an adapter. This is why I said that one of the bags has nearly all of the cables you need. If you don't know which cable to use, it will say on it smartphone or camera, just have a look at the image. Although this is called a mini smartphone video kit, it can be used with an action camera. I have a GoPro and this is how it looks put together. Because the tripod is sturdy and the ball head is strong, I can also fit a mirrorless camera like the Sony A7 or you can go for something smaller like the Sony ZV-1. But let's go back to the smartphone because this is how most of the vloggers will use this kit for. The phone feels secure, mine has a case on and the phone clamp keeps it in place. The only thing that you need to pay attention is the cold shoe mount or the hot shoe mount fitment. You need to tighten it as much as possible for the complete unit to stay put. Now that I put everything together, this is how the mini video kit is used. The sound is coming straight from the BSM-1 video microphone which is connected to my smartphone. I will only hear the sound recorded when I edit this video, hope it does a good job. As a comparison, this is how the sound is recorded via the integrated microphone on my phone. Can you notice any difference? Let me know in the comment section below. The kit feels comfortable to hold because most of the parts are made of plastic and are quite light. The kit doesn't feel heavy and I could probably hold it for a quite long period of time. Let's test the light as well. At the moment the light is off. Let's turn it on. Now the light is on with, uh, with a diffuser uh, and uh, it is on the first level. I switch it to the second level and this is the third level. Now if I remove the diffuser, this is how it looks on the first level, this is the second level and this is the third level. 
On the third level, without the diffuser, the light is quite strong, so try not to look into it. Uh, but yeah, at the moment you have six levels you can choose from. Let's put the diffuser back on and uh, turn off the light. If you get tired to hold your arm up, like this, just extend the tripod and keep the arm in a more relaxed position. You can use this video kit like this when vlogging or walking around, or you can place it on a flat surface for when you need a still camera and you have to use your hands or show something. And this is a great way to use the video kit. I am quite happy that US Key Vision included this carry bag. Most of the competition don't. If you are in the market for a smartphone vlogging kit that can be also used with uh, an action camera or with a small sm a mirrorless camera, then consider this kit. I will leave the link to US Key's Vision store on Amazon as they have different kits for different needs. The link to this product is also in the description. Please use it if you consider getting one as this is an affiliate link and will help the channel. I hope you enjoyed this video and found it useful. Don't forget to hit the like button if so and share it with anyone that is in the market for this type of product. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon to be notified when new video is out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.